Hello and welcome to another video here on Mickey Moose Creations. I wasn't sure if I wanted to put this here or on Megan Jane's adventures but I decided that it was more crafty and basically I got this idea from another YouTuber um, and it's sampling all of my washi tapes because it's coming to the end of the year I thought over the past five years I've really got into washi tapes and so Apart from a few which are going to be in a different haul video um, or bullet journaling video series that I'm going to start doing for 2021, these are all of my washi tapes. So I have them in these bags. I am um, becoming a bit more eco friendly, stuff like that, I'm trying not to use as much plastic. But these plastic bags are just some plastic bags that I had lying around um, and I use them mostly for keeping craft supplies in so I put all my washi tapes in them for now but after this I'm not just going to throw them away, I'm going to keep them again and then I'm going to um, reuse them to keep something else in basically uh, because they're very handy unfortunately um, and they're just something that I've used for a while. Um, over and over again, just thought I'd point that out, but I am going to show you all of my washi tapes. And when I had a rough count up of how many washi tapes I had, I had about 250, and that's quite a lot of washi tape. <laughs> so, I am um, this is gonna take quite a while. But I'm gonna try and get them into this notebook. <laughs> um, this notebook was given to me by one of my pen pals. Um, I got it a little while ago. It's really pretty, I love the pink and I thought it'd be perfect to put all my washes in. And so we will see how far we get. I'm hoping that they all fit into this one notebook. But we do not know. So yeah, what I'm going to do is I've split them into categories and I am going to speed through the sampling of them and I will voice over so that I tell you a bit about them because some of them I like more than others, some of them I bought when I was first starting out just to make a collection, some of them I bought from like cheap pound shops and stuff like that and some of them are a bit more expensive but yeah I think I've uh, blabbered on enough and I am going to go to voiceover and tell you about all my washi tapes. So I've broken each section up so first off I have my solid colours these are matte colours as well as uh, metallic so I've got some pinks, some blues and some golds and then I have the next section is glittery so I have some glittery, quite a lot of glittery washi tape in comparison I very rarely use these, they're not very sticky but I do have a small selection then I have like sets, I have a lot that are like um, I bought in a set, some of these are larger sets than others but these ones are Mermaid, Unicorn and Disney. And then I have Tropical, um, this came in a set from Paper Chase. Uh, the little pineapples came from uh, Hobbycraft. I have a lot of botanical themed washi tapes. Uh, those all came in one set and some of the others I bought on Etsy. So this took me over an hour of filming so I sped it up <laughs> to try and um, 
make it a bit shorter so here is the final video <laughs> after it is eight times speed so these are my animal themed washi tape i have quite a few animal ones these are some vintage animals then i have some birds those are like tropical foxes I have some under the sea themed uh, the one I put at the top are like little pandas um, giraffe print, rabbits sloths are common <laughs> and then I have skinny washies a lot of these my sister bought me a massive pack of them off of amazon for my birthday so there's like 20 or 40 different skinny washi tapes and they're really cool they range from like um fruit like lemons on one some are just spots or hearts or something some of them are puffy stars with like little faces which are super cute I realised that I stuck down the same sample twice, but that's fine. And those two small ones at the bottom were gifted to me. And then I have my patterned washi. This is basically just everything else that isn't Christmas. Um, so some, some animals here that I forgot to put in the animal section itself. So some flowers, some stripes some girls with girls faces there's some avocados and stuff i've got a couple of like london themed ones when i first started getting into washi i was really proud that i live in near london and so my original snail mails were like based around the fact that i live near london but now i'm not that bothered I was just a bit patriotic but I have lots of different um, patterns some were gifts some were bought by me some are new and some are older and then I have my favorites and whatnot that constellation one is one of my favorites the airplane one actually ran out after this. I've used it so much. Since making this video, I've actually used up some of my washi in like snail mail and stuff. So I got rid of quite a lot. But um, yeah, I still have quite a few. I was hoping to have put this video up by now, but it just, with exams and stuff, it just never happened. have some like fruity watercolour washi and then I have all of my Christmas and I really like the fairy light ones and basically most of these washies like I just have a draw for and sometimes I use them and sometimes I don't I am trying to use most of them up but this is just my collection that I've built up over the last like five years or something so I mean I like my collection I'm quite proud of it but I do need to use it I really like that Santa with the red and the gold it's really pretty one of my faves for Christmas anyway yeah so I've been through and I have sampled all my washies 
I've counted and in this book alone I have 230 different washi tape samples. That is not including the four new ones that I have. The old ones that are currently sat on my desk that I didn't sample because there's no point sampling them. And also doubles of the Christmas ones because I bought more because I had the idea of using them for Christmas cards and stuff and I also have rogue ones that are not kept with my washi tapes normally so yeah that is um that is quite a lot I also think I have more washi tapes at uni so yeah I started with colours and then glittery, the different sets, tropicals, botanicals, patterns, animals and little ones, more patterns, and Christmas, yeah! So yeah, thanks for watching this video, I hope you've enjoyed it, I didn't realise I had quite so many washi tapes but now that I do maybe I will stop buying them and actually use up the ones that I already have. But yeah, for more content from us at Megan Moose Creations, check out our, we have a Patreon, we have an Etsy, we have an Instagram and a Facebook, you can find us everywhere pretty much. But yeah, thanks for watching and I hope you had a nice Christmas and are looking forward to the new year. Bye for now.